Just another quick video. I am the Caveman, and this is Caveman Classics. And again, I have another piece of that copper water pipe that I've flattened out and polished up. And as you can see, I've drawn a line on it. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to make another set of earrings. But this time I'm going to try, the last time I did a twist in them, this time I'm going to do a loop. And I'm thinking that that's probably a good width right there for one. And after I have that one cut out, I'll cut out the second one. Then I'll have to file them down. And then get to the bending part. I haven't figured out exactly how I'm going to bend that on the size. But I'll figure that out here in a little bit. But first got to cut this one out. Mark out another one and then cut it out. When I get that done, I'll be back. So I got my two pieces cut out. Now I have to go and file this one down. I'm going to file this one down first, get it to the size that I want it, because this one's just a little bit wider. So when I get this one down to the size that I want, I'll then make this one equal to this. So I have this one done. Now I got to do this one. And as you can see, I got a black line right here that I have to file that down to make it equal. Then I will round off this end, keeping one end flat, so when I curl it up, it'll be flush. So that's what I gotta do next, is go and file that down. Drill the hole in it. Figured I'd do that so I'd know that it was right where I needed it, because there would be no need to work on a second one if I screwed the first one up. So I got one bent. It's not exactly what I was going for. I wanted to connect the two here. And I may still do that, but I'll have to find something small enough diameter that I can heat this up and wrap it the rest of the way. But it's getting there. Trial and error. I'm gonna go bend the second one here. You wanna get it to have a nice orange glow to it so that it bends easy. Let's see how that is. And yes, this is a socket on an extension. Partially bent here. Now I gotta let it cool because I have to bend it to match that one there. And I'll probably end up leaving them like that. I probably won't close the gap here. I'll just leave them open. But we'll see. But that's just how I bend it. And I know it's like I said, it's a socket on an extension. Maybe if I find some round pipe or something, I'll make something someday. So that I can bend this without having to use these, but you gotta make do with what you got. And there we go. Got them all cleaned up. I may or may not clear coat them. I haven't decided yet, but I mean, the shiny right now. Polished right up. Did give me another idea though when I had these two that if you put them together they make a heart. So that's given me an idea for some something else that I'm going to be working on. That's how the ideas come though. You know, you work on one thing and then something else pops into your head. But that's another set of earrings done. I think they came out pretty cool. They're good matches for each other. So there we go. Till next time.